So this program is nothing new. However, there hasn't been awareness around this program because at the end of the day, the government isn't teaching people on how to claim it. So the SETC stands for Self-Employed Tax Credit, and it's a specialized tax credit that's designed to support people who are self-employed during the pandemic. It really is that simple. If you are watching this right now and you were self-employed during the pandemic, there's a great chance that you're going to be able to claim tens of thousands of dollars of free money back into your pocket. And maybe if you're sitting here and you're saying, well, I don't know, I'm not self-employed or I wasn't self-employed. Well, I promise people in your family, your aunt, your uncle, your friends are self-employed. And this could be a tremendous benefit for you to be able to share this with them. So who qualifies for the, the this tax program? So anybody who is self-employed, right? That means anyone who was self-employed during 2020 and 2021. This is a pandemic program. So it doesn't matter what you are now. It doesn't matter what you were last year or 2022. This is for the pandemic. Think back, what were you doing during the pandemic? Were you self-employed during the pandemic? That means anyone who's running a business, a 1099 uh, subcontractor, single member, LLCs, if you file the Schedule C or partnership in your federal tax return. So basically, if you pay taxes, okay, during the pandemic and you were self-employed, you could potentially qualify. The second biggest criteria to, to qualify is were you impacted during the pandemic? Did you battle COVID-like symptoms? Did you need to quarantine? Did you go undergo testing? Did you care for a family member? Did your children's school get closed? I am pretty sure every single person on this call was impacted by the pandemic. Raise your hand if in some way, shape, or form you were impacted by the pandemic. I think I, I think I got COVID like five times. No joke. I lost, I remember I was in a hotel in Mexico and I, I wake up in the morning and I, I'm a I'm a big hot sauce guy. I love hot sauces. And I, I wake up and I'm, I'm eating. I'm like, this isn't a hot sauce. And, and the guy was like, this is a, an extremely hot sauce. I'm like, I can't taste it though. And that was the first time I discovered I lost my taste for about 30 days. I thought I was never going to get it back ever again. With that being said, I was impacted. Whether you made more money during the pandemic or not, because I know people that made more money during the pandemic, but it doesn't mean that you weren't impacted. The beautiful thing with this program is that it is a self-attestation. Okay, I'm going to explain that what that means. That means that you don't have to have a doctor's note or you don't have to have proof of your kids' schools or daycares being shut. If you are sitting here and you say, I was impacted, you're self-attesting and it means you were impacted. The government can't come back and say, hey, Allison, why, why were you? Can you provide proof that you were, right? You, if you feel that you were, you were, it's a self-attestation. So the, the biggest qualifying factors are, were you self-employed during the pandemic? Were you impacted by COVID? And finally, you have to have paid taxes. Okay, so if, unfortunately, if you had a horrible year and you made zero money, you're probably not going to get anything back. This is the, the government's way of saying, hey, GoGo, -Go, thank you for doing the right thing during the pandemic working hard. You did one of the most American things, which was paying your taxes. And now you are getting some of that money back. That's really all it is. It, it isn't a loan. It isn't one of those funding programs where we give you money and you have to pay it back. This is a program that was set aside for any self-employed individual where you can claim this free money. So why does nobody know about this? That's the question I always get. My own accountant told me, Alex, I have not heard about this. I have, it, it's a top three firm in the nation that does my accounting. He hadn't heard about it. Why? Because when the IRS, when you owe money to the IRS, they're knocking on your door, they're sending you emails, they're sending you texts, well, maybe not texts, but they're calling you, right? They're after you because you owe them. Like the other day, this is no joke, I got a notice that I owed, I think it was like a dollar and 30 cents back in 2018. And now they're coming back. I'm sure some of you have received a weird notice like that, but they're, they're claiming back even a dollar. But when they set aside $70 billion, which is the amount they set aside, 
they don't educate the public. And now I'm not a conspiracy theorist. I'm not here to tell you why that happens. I just know it doesn't happen and people aren't getting educated. If accountants don't know about this, how are me and you going to know about this? And how are we know how, how do we know how to do it? Right? It's like doing your taxes. People often ask me, Alex, but what if I find out about this and I can go do this myself? Well, I wouldn't recommend you go file your taxes yourself. This is the same thing. This is a very unique program where you have to have a certain expertise on how to do it. Okay, so that is why we recommend working with a company like ours that has the experience and knows exactly what, we, what we're doing and we can maximize this credit for you.